Hi, I'm Lindsay and I'm a zookeeper at the Detroit Zoo and I work with the penguins. I'm going to show you a little bit about what my day is like. So we come in super early and we have to get everything ready for the penguins and their routine. So the first step is to get their fish ready. We do use frozen fish, so we have to thaw it because the birds don't like to eat frozen fish. So we'll just put it in water, give it a quick rinse, and then bucket it up for the day. We use a variety of fish with the penguins because we want to provide different nutrients and vitamins. We use capelin, herring, and a tiny fish called silver sides, which is their favorite. It's kind of like candy for them. And every bird gets a special vitamin to help keep them healthy. And so we'll put that just right down into the fish and put the fish in a bucket or a pan and feed that to them uh, as their first fish of the day. We have a few older birds. We have an older flock of king penguins. So we have a few that are on special medications. So we will give that to them first thing in the morning. We'll watch how they're walking and see if there's any changes in their gait. If there is, we can call the vets up and see you know, if they need an exam or if we just wanna watch them. So we, we pay special attention to all of our birds and their individual needs. Every day as a keeper, we have to come in here and clean. This is their home and we do recognize that. So we have to pay special attention to where we're hosing. We don't wanna hose anybody. Um, we don't wanna disrupt if they're building their nest at nesting time. So we're really careful when we're cleaning in here. Once we're all done cleaning, we sit down and feed everybody. We do have the 86 birds, that's 86 mouths to feed. We'll sit down with a bucket of fish and actually hand feed every single one of them. We can tell all of the birds apart because they have bands on their flippers. And each one of those bands has a different color or a color code. And we can easily read that code and identify who it is. Most of our birds are trained to step up on a scale and we weigh them at least once a month to make sure that their weight is appropriate for their species of penguin. This is a really good tool for us to make sure they're eating enough. Um, and it's also a lot of fun for the birds to be able to do something and earn a reward for it. We'll also provide them some enrichment in the pool to give them some things to investigate. Today we have some ball pit balls that will kind of float around on the surface, get them interested, they'll push them around, and eventually we'll scoop them out later in the day as they've gotten tired of hanging out with those. So if you ever come to visit the zoo, you wanna come first thing in the morning, especially if you wanna come see the penguins because they're the most active. As they're waking up, they wanna go in the pool, they're gonna kinda of stretch their legs and swim around. You'll see the gentoos swimming around and porpoising. They are the fastest swimming species of penguin in the world. They can swim up to 22 miles an hour and I'm pretty sure they get close to that here at the zoo. I hope you enjoyed your sneak peek behind the scenes at the Polk Penguin Conservation Center. Now you know kind of what it's like to be a zookeeper here with the penguins at the Detroit Zoo. Hope to see you soon. Bye.